We are still at the very start of 2023 and we have another brand new ROM hack to play. What is up heroes and welcome to Pokemon Scale Fang. This looks absolutely awesome to play. If you guys want to play along, as always, a link in the description down below. Do go check the game out. Let's jump right into it. Please set the time. Okay. 335 is correct. Please choose your appearance by pressing left or right. So we're going to be the boy. Yes, we are. Put our name in. Voltsy. All good. Your name is Voltsy. Yes, it is. Oh, your name. Voltsy, wasn't it? I'm Alpha, the head captain of Access's task force. You must be wondering why you were called here. Well, I'll give it to you straight. You received a perfect score on the Access aptitude test. It's incredible. Nobody has achieved a perfect score before. There must be a well of potential inside of you. We've decided to take you into the company immediately. What do you think? Heh, <laughs> nice. Oh, character speaks. A perfect score is exactly what I expected. I was born to be a trainer, after all. But what's in it for me if I join you guys? You got a lot of confidence. I suppose it's to be expected of such a gifted kid. We'll give you a strong, rare Pokemon. Also, we'll kit you out with the latest gear we've developed. In return, you join our task force. Go where you're ordered and do what you're told. Rare Pokemon, latest gear, sounds good to me. A job that gets me out in the wild is a perfect fit. Brilliant to hear. Now then, there's a lot of paperwork we need to sign off on. Alright Voltsy, there are three Pokemon in the briefcase. They have their own strengths and weaknesses, but all of equal worth. Go ahead and pick one. Alright, so what are the starters? Huh, can I have all three of them? After all, I'm a perfect score in Superstar, right? <laughs> you cheeky brat. No, you get one and only one. We're not going to spoil you. Oh man, alright. Let's go and uh, check the briefcase. Ooh, okay, got some fakey mom. So we got, what's this? Chip copy. That's kind of cute. And then we got, uh... Alcaf. Oh, And then, uh... Paul Reedy? That's kind of cute. Oh, I don't know what to go for. I kind of feel like this one's going to be really sweet. I'm going to go for the Grass Starter. I don't usually go for, like, a Grass Starter often, but this one kind of... I know, it's calling out to me. Looks kind of cool. So take the uh, Revo phone as well. Okay, press R to use it. So Revo phones come with a number of useful applications to begin with, but that model is a special version. It's fitted with a special unit that contains unique data about your person. Both biological data, such as your fingerprint pattern, which was taken earlier, as well as information about your status with access, access is, is stored. With the Revo phone, you'll be able to access restricted areas, so don't lose it. It's an essential device that is as important as your heart and mind. There are some Pokeballs for you too. Ten Pokeballs, nice, nice, nice. So when you're sent on a mission, you'll get a call from us. We'll tell you where to go and what to do. For now, take the metro to the meadow and get some training in. Training in the meadow? This isn't what I expected. Isn't there anything more exciting for me to do? Don't get ahead of yourself now. You're just a Greenhorn trainer, and Greenhorns are unreliable. Go and get some experience and then you can tackle the fun stuff. I've got places to be. See you later. So we're definitely working for the bad guys, right? I don't know, they kind of seem a little shady. Uh, let's, uh, oh wow, the menu looks very different. So that saved the game. So we just press up. So the menu is very different. So it's got a sap sipper. Cross increases attack, okay. Leafage. So it's level one, oh. So when you open up the menu, you literally have to press left, right, down or up. So what's right? Oh, it's options, okay. Next, you can XP share on and off if you want. It's always going to make people love that. I'm going to keep it on. Can we just uh, walk through? Sweet. Uh, hi. 20 years ago, there was a great war against the beasts of the underworld. X-Access was born not long after that. Okay. So welcome to X-Access Barracks. Only authorized personnel may continue past this room. Alrighty. Let's go do some training then, shall we? Because I like how our character speaks, and I like how, uh, a bit, bit cheeky they are, but Voltsy, Voltsy, uh, hi. Uh, Mimosa, I was wondering where you were. Sorry, Voltsy, I tried to wait in the lobby, but the receptionist started making a fuss about me loitering, and I got kicked out. Anyway, what happened in there? I want to know everything. Getting caught up so suddenly means something awesome must have happened, right? As it happens, I scored perfectly on the aptitude test. Now they're taking me on as a new recruit for the task force. Whoa, as expected from you, Voltsy. You've always had a sharp eye when it comes to Pokemon, and Jordan X-Access. Uh, that, 
Uh, this is what you wanted, wasn't it? Of course. My goal is to un unite uh, Okai. To do that, I need to reach the un underworld where the army of the beasts live. But X Access has tight control of the border that separates us from the underworld. In order to get through, I have to work, work my way up the ranks. <laughs> Always loved your ambition, Boltsy. You're the only one who could dream of going to such a scary place. Seems like you've got a long journey ahead. So what have X-Access got you doing next? They're sending me down to the meadow to train. Pretty lame, but this should give me a chance to start building a strong team. To train? Oh, I can help with that. Uh, huh? How? Using the Pokemon, Pokemon my sister gave me as a gift, of course. If we battle, both our Pokemon will get valuable experience. How about it? Heh, <laughs> a battle? Sure. But I'm not gonna lose, you know. What? You suddenly started talking, though? Talking tough? Okay, then. Let's do it. I challenge you, Voltsy. Alright. Bring it on. Liking the battle music. Ooh. This is kind of cool. You got a Mareep. The UI's looking kind of nice, but let's just go Leafage. Love the back sprite as well. Alright. Keep spamming Leafage, and we should win easy. Keep growling, that's fine. And another Leafage to finish you off. Easy peasy. Woo! Nice, nice, nice. Wait, and we learnt Lee? No way, you got us. Got you. Easy, man. Not bad, you. I'd say X Access has a Ryzen Star on their hands. Thanks, Emosa. Oh, yeah, I have a new phone. Um, can you key in your number? Okay. There you go. By the way, you should make make sure you stock up on items before you leave town, Foxy. There are wild Pokemon and trainers itching for a fight all over the place. So you Pokemon will need uh, constant care. Whoa, look at the time. Need to get going. Leaders, Voltsy. I see ya. Well, let's go explore the town so we can find first. Alright, there's a dead end. Uh, what's up? So my mum says that, that after the war, Valenta City was just a pile of rubble. But look at it today. It's huge. Hard to believe it was almost completely destroyed 20 years ago. I mean, put the work in. 20 years. Believable. So if you're a trainer, there's one item you can't do without. Yeah, take this potion. Oh wow, thank you so much. That is literally right now the difference between life and death. <laughs> it's funny how like useless potions are, like normal potions, later in the game, but at the start they're just so good. So our Oakish people are fighters and innovators. We don't give up. Now, how come we're all alive today? Well, it's because miracles do exist. Hmm. I don't know if I believe in miracles. Now let's go and talk to this guy on the bench. Oh ho ho, you're part of the task force, you say? Young people must be a better trainers than ever before if kids as young as you are joining X Access. Uh, hi. Oh, talk to me, lady. There are hundreds of Pokemon living in Okai. Wonder what the exact number is. And I'm hoping there's going to be a lot of Fakemon. Because so far, the free starter Fakemon look so awesome. And, uh, yeah, I, I love Pokemon games with lots of Fakemon. So if this game does have can buy desks and stuff, okay. Oh yeah, 3,000 Poké Dollars? Sweet. Yeah, this game does have like a, you know, a lot of Fakemon. My team's gonna be full of them. But the only reason, the only way I'll use like original Pokemon is if they've got like a, like a custom form or Mega or Evolution or something like that. For, uh, yeah. Fakemon game, they'll use Fakemon and ooh, the Pokemon's that are looking, looking nice. So let's get healed up. Thank you very much. Oh, there you go. Uh, hi. So the art in the Pokemon Center sells battle-orientated goods. If you can't find what you're looking for, try the shop near the barracks. Uh, Pokemon Centers are places where you can have your Pokemon heal for free. That's common knowledge on the level of water being wet or the sky being blue. Uh, hello. This is the rest area. Uh, it's stocked with interest in books on Pokemon. That's nice. So I should buy... There's a lot of cool stuff already. Um, let's get like two antidotes just in case. Paralyze heal. And then let's get... We don't need any Pokeballs. We've got ten. I probably do. I love the music in this game. Got a really nice soundtrack so far. Uh, can we speak to you? Hi. So I'm trying to nap. Leave me alone. Okay, sorry, sir. We've got the Metro. Uh, hi. Good day. Where will you be traveling to? Uh, the meadow. Meadow? Have a nice trip. Oh, actually, we're going to the meadow. Okay, cool. 
So let me go back. I want to just finish exploring the town first. Didn't think it'd actually like just take me. I thought it'd be like, oh, you have to do something first, but... Uh, hi. X Access pays well for most jobs, but scientists working for them get a massive salary. I should have uh, majored in STEM. So I've been fascinated with Frosno lately, but I've uh, not had the chance to catch one. If you trade me a Frosno, you can have my Holofrolic in exchange? Okay. Ah, rats. My research continues. Okay, so that's... The game definitely has Fakey Mom, which is good. So, um, Frosno. We need to catch two of them so we can trade one. Rubber phones are so amazing. I want one so bad. You got a rubber phone? Wow, I'm jealous. Yeah, I'd be jealous too of me. I'm pretty awesome. <laughs> Alright, uh... So, I've got the speed of a... Chixily? You can't catch me. Won't give up trying to catch you. Just wait. There you go, you got her. <laughs> uh, this is locked. What is this place? Oh, the sewers. Probably don't want to go down there. So, Valenta City is Okai's capital city. Most of the population was born here. However, since the war, more settlements have uh, sprouted across the region. Okay, this is the capital. It doesn't seem too big for a capital, which is, which is nice. And the elevator won't open. It seems a card key is needed, which we do not have. And you're looking awesome. Hi. Young Pokemon are adorable, but when they grow up, they become uh, truly terrifying. Oh, was that the case? Uh, Okish Curious, uh, aren't they just trash? Why does my father hoard such pointless things? We don't understand him sometimes, jeez. Uh, Okish Curious, they are fragments of our ancient past, and such fragments can be found hidden all around. You do go to collect them and uh, give them to me. I'll reward you handsomely, of course. Okay. Not sure what they look like or <laughs> what they really are, but if I see them, I'll do it. Is the free starter Pokemon given by X Access? Do you have one of them? If so, please show me. Give you a Pokedoll, sure. There you go. Wow, it's your copy. Please take this. Something tells me secret bases might be a big part of this game, considering you can buy desks in that store already and then get a doll here. I'm down for it. Oh, you look very suspicious. Uh, do you know about abilities? Every Pokemon has one. Yes. <laughs> uh, hi. When I'm older, I'm going to study to be a scientist. And I'll join X Access and invent a new kind of Pokeball. Oh, wow. Cool dream, dude. So I think this is the last house. So the metro system was essential for evacuation during wartime. It must have saved countless lives. Uh, have you used Okai's metro system? I did. It's the best way to get around. Okie dokie. Anything up here for us to get? Oh, you look cool. So I don't know how many Pokemon exist across Okai, but it seems new discoveries are still being made. Being able to handle Pokemon well is one of the most desirable traits one can have. Nice, nice, nice. All right. Let's, uh... I think... Let's see, yeah, let's go south if we can. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, this is pretty. Memorial Bench. The wind always blows again. Nice. So can we go down? Oh wow, this place is a lot bigger than I thought. So we can't go through here, but we can still explore a little bit more. All right. So what is this place? Game Corner. Carve your name in arcade history. I gotta say, like, I wish like Pokemon would bring the casino back. Obviously not as a casino, but like a way just to do some little mini games or something for fun. Like, you know, the very good market for it, but what's this? Uh, you're wanting a coin case to store your coins? But well, you're in luck, a handcraft coin case, as you see. Yeah, I'll take a free one. Oh, wait, let's play a little game. I'll flip a coin if you tell me what side it lands on. You're not allowed to watch me flip it, though, obviously. If you guess correctly, I'll give you the coin case you're so desperately desiring. Deal? Deal. Now I'll flip the coin now, don't peek. Uh, I was going to say tails. I always usually go tails, but just come out and say it, kid. I can totally read your mind. The coin landed on tails, didn't it? Yes. Ah, it'd be- No! Ah, oh, you really wanted the coin case, didn't you? You can try again if you want. Ah, oh, okay. King and tails, aren't you? Read your mind, I'm gonna say no. You call my bluff, then your coin case you wanted so desperately. There you go, got the coin case. I wanna see what kind of Pokemon we can um, get from the slots, well, from prizes. So these are like, ooh, stuff for bases. And do you sell Pokemon? 
Rare Pokemon, okay. Mareep, Farfetch, Dunsparce, and Porygon. Eh. Has they got evolutions or forms? Not too fussed about that. So the Tawny Hub under construction. Oh, uh, my apologies, we're still preparing the building to be used for tournaments. Okay. So that is... Can we rock climb up there? It yeah, it looks rock climbable. Gotta remember that place so we can come back later on. So that's everything around the start in town. So now let's go to the meadow. Which is not through here, actually. My bad. Um, let's, yeah, go here. Go to the meadow. And do some training. Mellow Meadow. <laughs> I like the name. It might be me, but like... The grass and everything, the floor just looks really nice. Oh! Spin! Spin? Spin! I'm gonna say Spin. Oh, got a button for R to catch it right away. Come on. No! Ah, oh, if I can get it right away. Alright, so let me just uh, hit you with this. Shouldn't kill you. Yeah, not very effective. Uh, Sap Sipper, let's go! Try my luck again. I love the shortcut to throw Pokeballs. No! I feel like I'm gonna kill it. Why are you so hard to catch? You're level one! Yeah, you suck. <laughs> Alright, what else can we find? Oh, I'm so happy this game's got like a bunch of new fakey mom. The sprite for Lillipop actually looks kind of cute. Alright, uh, let me look around, do some ground. I don't think the speed up works on this. Yeah, the speed up kind of like crashes the game a little bit. So, um, it's going to take some time just to do a little bit of grinding and find the Pokemon we want. But I'll cut to when we either find something new or catch a Spin. Oh, wow, okay. The Chixley. That's the Pokemon the, uh, the little girl mentioned. Okay. Definitely going to catch this. It's been running into lots of uh, Lillipups, so I haven't caught a Spin yet, but I'm going to catch one. If I run out of Pokeballs, I'll probably run back to the city just to buy some more. Alright, going to go for another Leafage. That Growl is kind of annoying, but I want to try and get a red HP. Yeah, so this game has got the speed up buttons that is disabled. I'm just trying to like, test that out a little bit, but I mean, it's good. But for grinding and wild battles, it's gonna be oh, it's gonna be tough. There we go, we caught it. All right, I'm guessing it's just gonna be like probably flying, normal flying. The chicks they typically live inland within the forests and plains before going out to hunt for food. It chirps loudly to boost its own morale. Ah, that's kind of cute. Uh, let's check our Pokemon out. Just flying, okay. Prevents uh, defense loss. Ooh. It's not bad, not bad. I'm gonna lead off with it just in case we find a spin again and then I can just um, peck it a little bit and it'll be a little bit easier. Right, can we get a spin right away? Is it gonna be a spin? No, it's a marine. Alright, I'll see you guys when we catch a spin. Wait, there we go. Spin is actually really hard to catch. Took multiple tries, but we got it. Pokemon better be good. The Bean Pokemon. The Bean are quick to try and get to their next evolution. In the state that they're they're in now, it's difficult for them to fend for themselves and survive. Oh, that's actually kind of sad. Yeah, very cute though. All right. Oh wow. Flowers are pretty. Ooh. Beeline. Got a bee. All right. Let's go. Leafage. The struggle bug. That's gonna hurt. And my special attack went down, that's fine. I'm gonna just try and catch you right now. Come on, be cool. Be cool, be be cool, get it? Be Yeah! Be beautiful! <laughs> oh I called it B because I'm awesome. <laughs> my B puns are just 
I don't know, anything else but beautiful. <laughs> so small and nimble, the beeline makes itself very hard to land on, land a hit on. And then counterattacks by stinging the foe multiple times. Okay. That's awesome. I already got four Pokemon on the team. I love Fakemon, man. And Marie, I probably should go heal up actually, I'm a little bit weak. Um, yeah, so let me go get healed up. And then we can come back here and then fight that guy. Just don't want to obviously fight and then end up losing because everyone on my team is super weak from the from the catch and the Pokemon. So I'll see you guys back in a sec. Alright, we're back. Nice and healthy. Also, I think XP share only works on the Pokemon that's second in the party slot. I think. Go double check. Obviously, I can test the theory out once we do this battle. So when two trainers' eyes meet, they have to battle. You already knew that, didn't you? I did. Alright, bring it on. What you got for us? Youngster Sven got Chixley, okay. Um, not the best matchup here, but... Growl me, okay. And you're level 2. Another growl, I mean, probably three pecs will do the job here. It's all good, it's all good, nothing to worry about. And then one more finish you off. If you potioned up, I would have been so upset. But I think we all good. Chicksley level 2. No, okay, I was wrong, I was wrong. I guess it's just, it's highlighted just in case, um, for a double battle. And when I was running back, only one Pokemon, like, leveled up and I fought at level 1. Surely, more Pokemon would level up, but... Okay, that's good. I'm very happy about that, because if it was just one Pokemon at a time, that would make grinding even more stressful. What are we got here? Uh, hello, my good man. Berry trees will bear fruit once a day. There are many uh, berries with useful effects in battle, so make sure you pick every berry tree you see. Of course, berries aren't just useful as a held item in Pokemon battles. They're also a large part of the Oakish diet. Alright, nice. Uh, let's go and grab this. Got the potion, so sweet. Anything else? Nope. Wait, we can go round, I think, but let's fight you. Oh, hey, can I live stream our battle? <laughs> Go for it. I'm gonna embarrass all your viewers. I'm gonna be rude and shout myself out. Get all your loyal subscribers to leave and come to me. Give me all them membership don donations, them Twitch primes. All that good stuff. Yeah, you just embarrass yourself in, in your stream. How do you feel? <laughs> nice, bean level three. It learned growth. It's getting there, my bean's growing. And my bee is growing! Poison sting, nice, let's go! Woo! Oops, this won't be on the highlight reel. Nope, it's gonna be on live stream fails. <laughs> uh, there's uh, loads of different ways to go. Oh, when I was in the Pokemon Center, I should have seen if there was a map. I wanna see what the region looks like. I do love seeing regions. Sup, so, have you been catching Pokemon using honey? There are many amber trees across Okai, and different Pokemon will appear in different habitats. I don't have any honey, but I will take this berry. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, I want to go down this way. I want to go the wrong way just to explore a little bit, and that's, yeah, okay, dead end. Any sign now, no? Uh, hi! My Pokeballs are locked and loaded. Good. What you got for us, sir? Youngster Jimmy has a Lillipop. I do love Lillipup's like face in this game. It's just, it looks so cute, adorable. Ah, oh, it's so cute. Right, bite, not an issue. All good. I should get level five. Right? Anyone else want to grow a level? I mean, it's fairly experience. At this point, it should be. Yeah. Everyone at least growing like one level. It's total defeat for me. Yes, it is. Uh, let's go this way. We get a Pokeball, which is good because I kind of use a lot of Pokeballs trying to get that spin. And from as far as I can tell, we probably got all the Route 1 Pokemon. Oh, we got an Old Rod. Take that back. Let's see if we can catch a Water Pokemon. Just don't be a Magikarp. Be something new and cool. Uh, all right. Old Rod. Uh, 
What we got? What we got? What we got? Polywag. Ah. Don't want a polywag. I don't take you out because it'll be easy to take you out. Gonna go for one more encounter with the old rod. In case we can find something new. We're gonna have to fake him on here. Only fake him on. It's a better to like register you and I can just do select. There you go. Not even a nibble. Come on, come on, come on. Right, here we go. New Pokemon. New Pokemon. Ah, Poliwag, you suck. Alright. Let's just continue on. Oh, hi. Uh, even if two Pokemon have the same type, they fight differently. That is true. Alright. Oh! That is kind of cool. Alright. Uh, this peck looks like a grass type, right? Maybe not. Maybe like a rock type, rock grass? I don't know what type you are. I feel like it might be rock grass. I probably shouldn't catch another grass type considering we've already got two. <laughs> Get a whole team of grass. Gonna be a grass trainer for this game. Alright, another Chixley. I do love Chixley, it looks so cute. Let's just run away. Ooh. Let's go and grab this. What we got? It looks like the root design is really nice as well. I got the flowers and just the layout. So I feel this game very interesting. That character speaks as well, which is very different. Very good game. I like things that are a little bit different, you know? Like it's good to like a, for a game to stick to the traditional sort of format, but it's also good for a game to not stick to it. You know what I mean? It's also good for a game to kind of do both. Can't go wrong, really. So, gotcha! You walked right into a battle. Good. Show me some new Pokemon. Otherwise, you are just not interested at all. Oh, we got. Oh, that looks so cute! Nuttail. Alright. You know what? I want it. It's not very effective, okay. But it's, I mean, it still can. I was to say, take it out now with this leafage, but it's gonna take two now. Just look at his face. He's got like a really happy, innocent face, but the rest of the body just screams to me like, I'm gonna murder you, you know? Oh, that's so cute. Alright. Trainer tips, the sign is being vandalized. Strong trainers don't need tips, okay? Let's paint over. I'm always down with some tips. Alright, so that ledge there takes us back to where the, um... The little house was and the berry guy, not berry guy, the honey guy. Oh, what do we got here? Come on, show me that squirrel, nut tail. I want it. All right. Uh, so we, yeah, we're gonna continue going down. I think this meadow is actually really big. Because there's another way we can go. We can go north. Not sure if this is the right way to go or the wrong way, but if it is the right way or wrong way, I'm gonna go the other way as well, just to. Explore a little bit. But if we're not going to have um, the speed up button, I need to make sure I always have repels on hand then, going forward. Because sometimes if you just want to get through grass, it's going to be... It's going to be a bit hard. Oh! Hmm. Screw. So good! You! You're eating honey out of the jar? What the hell? <laughs> Stop doing that, it's creepy! Hey, are you listening? You finished the whole jar, what, 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 you're a trainer, right? What kind of question is that? Everyone around here trains Pokemon. If you're a trainer, then greet people with a let's battle. Jeez, you turn aggressive quick. What's with that outfit? Black jacket, fingerless gloves, wrist bandages. Some kind of tough guy, are ya? Hey man, I wear fingerless gloves and a black jacket. <laughs> and your provocations? They're annoying. I'll defeat you with just one Pokemon. Just one Pokemon? <laughs> it's a pretty arrogant thing to say. Enough small talk. Put your money where your mouth is and fight. Liking the battle music here. Oh, you got a pincer. Oh, that's gonna be easy. Pick! Oh, seismic toss. Um, yeah, it should still be fine. 
Uh, I should definitely heal up. Got six damage, I can take two more of those. Alright, go for another pick. Should live with one, yep. Nice. And another potion. To be fair, it's actually a pretty tough battle. I mean, definitely winnable. Right, peck. Oh, cyclic toss, that's fine. Nice! There we go. Ooh, that XP. 156. That might be level 7, right? Ooh, close. Chixley, level 5. Speen, level 5. What about you, Beeline? Hey, level 5 as well. Hey, you're not so cocky anymore, are you? Nah, how'd you like that? Looks like you're not so tough after all. Hm, don't get so cocky. Your puny Pokemon can never handle my full team. Interesting. What's his problem? Such a moody guy. Oh, Alpha's calling. Boltsy, head to the briefing room. It's time uh, we got you started on a mission. Interesting, okay. Well, I think it's probably a great place to end this pod off. Next episode, we're gonna... I think I'm gonna go just check out the little north side of the meadow. And then we'll head back and uh, pick up our mission. This game, very interesting so far. Excited to see where it goes. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great day. Peace.